Good morning, happy people. How are you guys doing today? It's another beautiful day here in Georgetown, Guyana. And guess what? We're at Freedom Hoop. And we're heading down to the mighty Wakenham Island today. All right. We're on another road trip. We want to bring you guys the island of Wakana. Wakana means waiting a name. That's what I heard. I got a relative over there, my cousin. I got to go and visit the man. Give you all a tour of the island. Hey, life can get better than this. I'm the only one visiting Wakana so many times. And I hope you guys have an awesome time there you guys are gonna like it and I know for sure most of you viewers haven't been to Wakenham join me and let me head down to Wakenham and let me go discover the beautiful island of Wakenham so we get to be boat here see the Perico Wakenham this new Wakenham boat right to the front here all right the crossover from Perico to Wakenham is five US dollar thousand Guyana these boats got like 21 passengers, but they don't carry full amount because of COVID. Or you can get a small boat, about fifty dollars to hire that boat to take you over if you want to go fast. All right, but you can go with this boat for just five dollars per person. The big boat charges maybe a dollar per person to get to the but that, you know that got scheduled time based on the water, the tide. So you know we don't here getting a boat now and. Miss Lynch, why are you holding me? Frank, no follow for board? No. What? Is that too much for the edge? Miss Lynch said it's too much <laughs> to the edge. And look, look where they look. <laughs> no, let me, go, let me go to the edge. Now, this is the edge, right? I stand up here now, Miss Lynch. Now, I stand up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to be Jack. Are you going to be Rose Dawson to jump for me? <laughs> if I jump for board, she I'm jumping for me, no? I'm trying to prevent it. <laughs> so come here. Miss Lynch, I'm a fisherman. I can jump for board. That's okay. All right. Anyway, the journey continues. So this this my captain here. What's your name? Wesley. Wesley. All right, yes, my brother. Girls man. Girls man. Yes. So we live in the mighty Parika here. We in the boat. Going down to Wakenham, boy. Beautiful this morning we started off it was so cloudy it was the rain was drizzling but now man we're all nice so we got them the taxi guys down here you know it's a really big boat here too all right so hey the goodness continue Wakenham Island begins here all right See the folks are smiling man, look very welcoming. Alright, in the country, people are always nice. <laughs> very nice people in the countryside. Come on, how y'all doing buddy? Alright. So we don't hear waking up. What's going on? Good morning everybody. No, it's afternoon already, chap. Where are you Good day. How about I could act there, One village? Well, I'll be walk, man. I'll go by Terry. 
Oh, by Terry then. You lose the stands? All right, I'm going to go with the bus then. All right, all right. So I'm going to go with the bus then. All right. This man said we're going to go with the bus then. We're going to go with the bus. You all know the show? Yeah, yeah. Nice, man. Nice. What's your name, man? Azad. Azad. Nice video, man. And the man girls, man, over there, buddy. Yeah, yeah. We famous captain. All right, gentlemen. Nice, appreciate man, appreciate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, we're here to discover we can arm. I bring in my family for the first trip. Yeah, look, man, go. Who owns this mango tree? Are you public on the road or somebody own? Are you pick one? You, you can pick, right? Pick, yeah. All right. <laughs> <laughs> then might give you permission to pick the mango, you know. See how we can arm people nice. I tell you, our country people are real nice, you know. This is what village you're part of? Artville. Artville? Artville. Artville. And this is your driver here, by what's your name? Akash. Akash. All right. Akash means uh, Akash Bani, that's like magic or something. Oh, what do you mean your name by? A very powerful name you got to do. It's Sky. Sky, oh, Sky, yeah, Akash Bani, yeah, the Sky, okay, the Sky God. So we in uh, Archerville, Archerville, right? We can have. So some of you folks who left this place long ago, we're America and Canada, well, like, yeah, I'm gonna see what it looks like now, you know. What that school name over there? Archerville Primary. Archerville Primary, lovely. All right, all right. Hey. Life can't get better than this, boy. We in Wakenham here. Hey? Touring the island. I'm gonna check out my cousin, you know. The man, only one and only snow cone man on the island, boy. Diana. Alright. Yeah. Well, what am I doing on this island, man? Like cattle farming, rice yeah. farming, and so. Cattle, rice, coconut, coconut, banana planting, and so. Yeah. Nice, nice. What about fishing and things? Not much fishing, all right. Yeah, there's enough hassa here, I think. Mm -hmm. All right, man, I'll come back here to catch hassa one day, boy. Now tell me when I reach the next village, right, friend? Yeah. Isn't it like dark now? Yeah. Like could dark, boy. Yeah, a little rum shop here, boy. We can come back there. I know about Terry, you live next to the water pump. The pump is station closed now, or you still operating? Still, still working, lovely. All right. I used to come here by back in the 90s, why? Right? I've been no man in name Tiger Tiger Bear, man in name uh, front side. Tiger Tiger or Tiger Bear or something or something. Tiger Bear. You still around or are you far as I'm? Guys? Okay. Oh, you go into the US? Oh, nice, nice. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. This blue house here, my, my cousin's house. Lovely, lovely. Look things for this man got here, boy. What? This man cook off a storm for we? Nice egg ball and thing there, man. This man making the chicken foot right now, chap. And when I say, I see a chul, huh? Yeah, I love, I love chicken foot. Look what I got here. Hey, can't get fresher than this, boy. Lovely, lovely. Now, this cutting require a special set of skill, boy. What this man doing here? Nice, nice. All right, look what going on here, boy. Yeah, all know. My cousin know I love fruits. And look what this man gave for me here. He said it's a week and I'm apple, right? Mm. Lovely. We can have my apple. Right. Can't get fresher than this boy. Alright, so are they right under the tree by? Look at this. Cashew. This is how cashew grew. What what really from my face here by watch? See that? Look at this. Can't get fresher. I'm more fresh on this. Mm. Half the tree into your mouth. Cause this is what cashew tree look like. All right. See my uncle got the operation. That the man just make nice egg ball and um cassava ball and chicken foot and thing, man. The man just a snow cone, man. You know, popular man from the island here. It's got a big fire side there. We gotta come back a day here and cook up, cook up a goat or a, or a sheep, you know. Cheers. Look, chicken foot here, boy. Man. I love my little friend here. Get, I'll give me some food, right? Alright. Chicken foot. Good, are they? Thank you. Very sour. How many minutes, food? Aye. Mm hmm. This is the real thing. Crunchy and real nice. 
some people have baked the chicken for first like they bake it like a roti then they fry it that's too hard if y'all watching this video please don't bake the thing and then fry me too hard him break my teeth and i want to get them chores but this you know is the real thing boy look at the beauty of egg ball here and cassava ball see that can get fresher than this cheers mm. Mm -hmm. This, this cassava sauce sauce, why like you, you blend the cassava or No, it's the type, type of cassava you like. The type of it? Yeah. The cassava is really, really smooth. Yeah, well, let me, let me know if, if you now buy it, let's put a little bacon on the side. Oh. And bring shit to suit. To suit you, it's getting smooth. You got to do, you got to do, man. So, so yeah, I hear the trick. Me, I, me since you got to try it now, put some baking powder in the cassava next time you cook it. Yeah. Get a sauce. I thought, I thought you blend the cassava then cook no. it. <laughs> Cheers. I look, my, my cousin cook a nice big Pot of um, chow mein and chicken here, boy. Nice, nice. Hey, country people are treat you real nice, you know. <laughs> so I'm going to buy Akash and I'm going to buy Arnold. Thanks a lot, them all. Let me pick up a drive around the island, right? Thanks a lot, friend. Yeah. yeah. So, hey, yeah, when I, if I come out a week and I'm sure I'll check this man um, boat surface, right? Arnold boat surface. This man let me pick up a drive around the island. So, and this my, my cousin here, man. This is my mother cousin. Mm -hmm. So it's me, 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 me uncle then, right? Come my mother and him, their cousins. And you see how we can have people nice? I tell you, I don't know, country people are real nice. Man, let me feel cool. Can't thank him enough. All right? And look farm over there by watch the nicest banana plant. You know, so the man has got over there by real nice, you know. We have these folks at the back. Hello. Right? Yes. Hello. This is the best part of the journey. Yes. <laughs> yes. And this is one of the main mode of transport in um, we can have motorcycle. Or bicycle, all right. Good. So we now we heading down to the um the stelling, the weekend arm stelling. I will show you all along there, right? Let me see if I can see the guy Anil. The man was right here who lent me the vehicle. Let's see if I can spot him. I ain't seen. Okay, all the way over here with a puppy. Oh. Hey, friend. Adel, thanks a lot to man for landing with the vehicle. Don't worry. Yeah, the man is a big farmer here, man. Alright, so. We can have, we can have this, this huge with rice farm. And there's a tractor blowing up the land there. Right now. Before you could sh uh, scatter the seeds, the body seeds. I don't know if you remember the burial ground down here. So, I might not be able to tell y'all all the names of the villages here. But hey, whenever I see um, signs of or I can ask people to tell me, I will. I, I will find out the name for the village. So you guys who belong to Wakana would know all these villages. I know Zelanja is somewhere at the back. I've never been there, I guess. But I would usually come from um, the speedboat there to the to the big boat on the wharf. I know that area. We got a beautiful pink house here, blue roof. Nice. So without a head, I think the Malali boat is there. We might be lucky to see the Malali boat. What is this, Yeah, I can see the boat at the, at the top of the boat at the back, you know, in the ear. Where the captain is. Oops! Humpy, humpy, humpy. Hold on, guys! I think it's a Mara's pleasure. I think, I don't know. What is the area name? Ask the girl what this village name where they're selling there. What is the village name of Fronte? The village, what is the name of the village? Bell Plain. Plain. Alright. So we in Bell Plain. Luckily I got my cousin daughter. She said we in Bell Plain here. And this is where the stelling is. Yep. Miss Lynch, you wanna call live a week and I'm? Oh you're a miss Garrett. I'm thinking I'm 
I might mean, I might mischarge them, but um let me let me browse spots and see. Okay. It's my first time here, so I'm not sure. No problem, no problem, darling. Well, Namalali is a is a is a big ship. At the front here. This is the, the police station, that's San Susi. San Susi police station. Front here probably is San Sushi, San Susi. Are you selling the down here? Yeah, I make a left and I make a right. Yeah. We heading right there, girl. We going to the going to the selling here. Lovely. And this is San Susi, huh? San Susi. All right. Come on, bangs, yeah, you should check the Rado sign, um, DDL. Five year old, y'all. Yeah. Gotta work for the sign, you know. Bicycle by it remind me of the days in SQ. Oh. Yeah, riding we bicycle. Going to work and do all things. You got a little, your little music box on the arm. Uh, bicycle. bicycle yeah. Big over the ship there man. Alright, got a beautiful house here man. Big house here. Wow. Here it, here we go in, slowly, slowly. I think I'm officially lost. Like, yeah. How long ago I didn't come here? When my grandmother died at the came. Mm -hmm. That was several years ago, but I didn't come all the way to the front here. I think the stellan is right down here, the way this white car is. You turn right, mm -hmm. and you're gonna reach the stellan. No, it's rice mill, sir. That's a rice mill, an old rice mill there. Mm -hmm. I don't know how many rice mills here. Right, we can now we're gonna house this already. Where the stellan there? I'm probably, I think you got a, a funeral here, I believe, or these guys are waiting. Ford. Clifford Joseph, how are you? Regular family. Fine. Lovely brother, lovely. Nice to meet you man. Yeah, I'm from East Van Grove. Oh, from Grove? Yeah, I come And look where we reached till we can have. Yeah, come to the funeral. <laughs> for the funeral here, yeah, nice. Like your program, buddy. Thank you man, thank you. Good to I'm meet you man. Welcome back to Guyana. Thank you man. All right, good to see you all. All right, all right. cool buddy. Yeah. Boy, the water is so high right now. Look at this. Man, look at the beauty here buddy. Now that over there is Essequibo Coast. You have adventure down that side. And a little bit more there is an island called the Hamburg Island. And this side is Supernam, where the speedboat takes you to Supernam there. And this wharf here have so much memory for me. Remember I used to come here back in the, in the 80s, the late 80s, early 90s. We used to get the first place I ever eat bile carn was on this wharf. Alright, and you have the weekend and post office there, and you got a rest house. Maybe I don't know if it's a guest house of government workers or what, but hey, beautiful, beautiful. This sail is the main port of entry for vehicles, like for large vehicles and for cargo and stuff. You know, you bring in your goods and things from Georgetown. This is the, um, the place here. Can I look so small or back in this was like so big? Is it possible I can get a piece of walk out there? Thank you all very much. Nice to meet you all, alright? Yeah, so the folks here are so nice they allow me to walk out and 
to reminisce on the good old days when we used to sit down here for catch a big boat by. Wow. Malali used to come in and all the snow cone man, Uncle Tongi. That's my cousin father. Might as well sell him right down here. Stand up right here and sell him with a bicycle. Back in the late 80s, you know. And the 90s and thing. And unfortunately he died. Sadly he died. But back then, we used to come with the boat in night time, mainly night time. Like when you leave Georgetown, Parika 5 o'clock, you get here by 7 o'clock. So it's like night or like 8 o'clock and stuff. And when you leave SC Cribo back in them days in the 80s, you leave like 3 o'clock in the morning. So by 4 o'clock, 4 to you're down here. So you always come here night time unless you come in the weekend and you're overnight. Then the next day you get to see the place, right? Or if you come speedboat. So, hey. The good old days here, boy. I just remembering and reminiscing on the good old days. How much of y'all from far in remember this Parika selling here? Sorry, the weekend I'm selling here. I guess enough of you guys remember the selling, man. You know? Hey. You want to live here? You want to live in the direction, boy? Go back and forth. Go back and forth? Smart answer, boy. Smart answer. <laughs> but I guess I'll be go back and forth. All right, so, hey. The goodness continue. Let me give you guys an aerial view of the stellen here. All right. Like a bird on a tree, I'm just sitting here. I got time, it's clear to see From up here, the world seems small We can sit together, it's so beautiful
back to earth all right so we now going into Sierra you know I didn't know I'm a, a, a man down here the name Tiger so I can't remember which house he the man live right Tiger and um, I also had a friend by the name of Sierra George my co-worker we, we work at the um, Back in Queensway, back in the 90s, you know. Queensway fashion, we, you know, I was a driver there and she was a sales person. I know she belonged to somewhere in uh, um, the Wakenham Island here. I was told. Hey. So the goodness continue. We continue to bring you Wakenham Island. I know the tune. Wakenham is an island surrounded by the sea. Miss take on lucky girl like Miss Lynch to find a man like me. Is that a tune? Alright. <laughs> you don't find good man like me no more, you know. They don't make them these kind of models no more, you know. What is it, Miss Lynch? Who could wash and cook and do all kinds of things? And they're mine. And then you don't find women like Miss Lynch there, right? That can wash and cook. They don't make those models no more, right? Good. They can show you a new model now. <laughs> Alright? Upgrade. Computerized upgraded model. Who knows about computer and um, don't like to cook and so I like to go to restaurants. There's probably Sierra here, I don't know. Trevini man dear. Hold on my cousin call me, let me answer you. Hey cousin. Alright, so the go this is my village girl. Bell Plain? Yeah. So we in Bell Plain village here now. So I gotta find out from my cousin that to, you know, the name of the village because I ain't know them too proper. I ain't really come around here a lot. And as a matter of fact, I never really come past this area. I only I was only visiting parts of the island. Thank you, Auntie. Got some beautiful houses here, man. That's coconut there, boy. Nice, nice. Sky juice. Mm -hmm. Just in the bag, Mikey. One battery is done already, so we already finished up a battery, you know. We got the second battery now. I really wanted a house like on a beach front here that's a zero that's a zero no it's a zero right. are we in zero village here and of course to my right is the cottage hospital we can have cottage hospital you can't miss it beautiful mustard color building and we continuing on to zero village So give me all village by village of Wakenham Island, you know. I don't know how long this video is gonna be if I gotta do two parts, but at least I wanna bring you the entire Wakenham. Those of you who leave Wakenham many years ago, you can have a look at what your past community looks like. I know a lot of folks from here, most of these houses empty man, people go away to America and Canada, England, you know. Quartz color, we have a we have a yellow house like quartz, then we have pink house, we have like green. Yeah, beautiful colors man, which is nice, you know. Look like Jamaica we at. <laughs> that is golden green color. We got a beautiful mandir here. This is our village girl. This Sarah still? Sarah up to now. Alright. When the party base is what village? Free and easy. All right, so we're heading into um, free and easy. I see wait, is a bell playing North Street School, man, down here. Hi. Watch over some, don't get some bell playing here. Hello, going on. Oh. Over some belly playing, watch. Watch for you, watch for you on the other side of the school. So this belly playing North Street School. 
So we have better play on maybe the next village is free and easy. Not not sure. My tour guide already know this place too good, you know. I could take a shower in the trench there, but you know we used to do back to the days, you know. Take a shower in the trench. You know them people this in this um Waking Ham Island very nice, you know. You could stop anyone at these houses here, ask them for a bottle of water or you know, a fruit a fruit they will give to you man. Trust me. Nice people. Hmm? I know there's somebody friends the yard. They probably live in oh you got a big house in back there, nice house. No. That doesn't seem to be a road where we're gonna drive. Yeah. Right, so don't hey, oh this must be free and easy start here after this bridge is here, I'll tell me. Alright. So probably it's a free and easy village, not sure. Let me see if I wanna see anybody and ask them the name of the village. Of course you're right around this whole island and sell um, snacks, you know. The man knows this whole village. Most of planting farming and banana farming going on here, boy. But bread fruit, there, boy. Nice, nice. Make sure your hands are in here for holy camera. I'm changing it, that's fine. Alright. So now we reach our point here now. For our people. For our fans. Our family, lovely. Look, man, go and say bye. Now, where are we going? We're going straight here. Yeah, you know where we're going straight? I don't know where we're going. We're going through. This is this is like the country um in the Philippines with all the banana tree by all the summer tree. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the bananas are planted in there, boy. Woo. So we got another rice mill here. You know, I've got a friend of mine, a friend of mine, my young man told me this place at one time had about 21 rice mills in total. So they probably had a lot of small rice mills, you know, these bottom house mills and things. You know. Bankal Estate, Plantation Bankal Estate. Lovely, and look at the river right over there. There's no problem. So our tour guide can't remember all the village name, but that's all right. So Plantation Blancal, we're heading here to right now. This, this probably was another rice mill too. Down here? Probably. Small rice mill, yes. Yeah. So that couple we see so far, about four we see so far. So we leave in Plantation not sure where we head into here, but this is rice field down here, rice land. More planting and banana tree. Let me see if we can read this thing. Where are we getting for girl? This sorry, going that side. Left or right? This is? Oh, there's a sign here. This I carry back to the boat. Yeah. All right. Oh, for God, should I go to Zilanga? How far in? Now the road to go in a Zelanda or Zelandia, Zelandia, kinda. What I'm planting a nice thing. You can pick up two bunch of them. Yeah. Like a seller for it. <laughs> the road really bad to go in there. Alright, so we gotta take the time on it. I think it's time to get it back. I don't know if it's a trench I'm gonna drive in here. Mm -hmm. Oh my god, look at this trench. I can't wait for Zelandia. I hope it's not. You think you're going? Nah, I don't think I'm going farther than this. Zelanda, I'm sorry, I was hoping to come by you, but look at this. Not this guy here, see if he can pass. Hey, how far is Zelanda there? Far? No, no, but you see, don't follow water, can't get past there. But the water doesn't have me want a chance for the engine cut off. 
Okay, but how much? Oh, a mile more or how far more? I got no. What, what the bag there? <laughs> you ready? Let me see how far the water deep. You ready? Let me see. Yeah, these guys say what? Well, um, vehicle pass, bus pass here whole day. But I'm still calling on the people, the relevant authority that are responsible for this road. Please fix this road for these families at the back of Zealandia, right? Good. So the fella told me another mile more at the back, you can get some houses at the back here. Yeah. Alright, so we in Zealandia here. And it's at the back point of the Wakenham Island. I know some of y'all from Zealandia. I always heard, I always heard about Zealandia, Zealandia. But now I'm here. Having a forest hand look at it. Also bringing some footage for you guys. Nice catch of tree here, buddy. And the man hammock and though. This road is terrible in the back here, buddy. Terrible. Here's some farming going on. And that's basically it. I don't know how far the village is, or if there's any other village at the back here. Not sure if this is the end of Zelanda. farm we got alright we got another turn and we got a house for along the Bible going on and then people said they can't wait America and the house for along we got another house abandoned here too and these folks probably in America too a lot of people go away to the states you know to Canada America England Leaving the house down here. A lot of old houses, man. See all these old houses here? Like these people went the way to the states, boy. And there's four houses in a row. As you land at center. Excellent. Hi darling, how you doing? How far more we can drive go? Another farm? Oh, you got farm over there? And the village in there? Yeah, we're Thank you. So the, the security there advised us we got less than a mile more to go. So as we're here, I'm just going to be complete the land there, right? Okay. Abandoned houses at the back here. Yeah, we that everybody go away to um, Jarstown. Mm -hmm. Some go way to West Coast, Essequibo, America, you know, different, different places. So, guys, what we're gonna do, I'm gonna end the video here at the end of Zelandia, or Zelandia, and then I'm gonna do part two from the other villages going back, our trip back to Georgetown, alright? 
Guys, I don't want the videos to, to be too long. I'm gonna have a spirit in the room. Don't you run out the energy? Yes. I can see so people in the back of this road. I hope I hope the the people responsible can build this road and fix this road, man. Zelandia, Zelandia Primary School, not Zelandia. D I A, Zelandia. Z E E L A N D I A, Zelandia Primary School. The security seven are going to turn. That should be the end there. So, looks like we reached the end of the um, Zelandia here. Yes, this is another race mill, number five. If we keep driving, we're probably gonna find out when we want. The rest of the island is Zealandia, Caledonia. And here, what am I looking at? Pier of Nador is coconut. Coconut strike, coconut stem for um, transporting there, maybe to Georgetown. All right, so this is the end of the tunnel here. We are out on the seawall front, the beach front, and that is Essequibo across the boy. This is so close we reached to Essequibo. It may not have come, it may not have no Zealand, yeah, so nice, nice for so. Nice to show here, there, one as well. Like a marina or a mega jetty there. Uh, Way up in the front there. Let me see if a lady pregnant that she got going. From here? She made the baby right there. Look, right look how rain falling over there. Right you want a picture? Yeah, right here. It's just stop right here. So, Miss Lynch wants some pictures here. Alright. This is um, the end of Zelandia. I let the girls um, inside the truck here. Hi! Yes! <laughs> Alright, so. My sense photo shooting right now. So let, let me go up a piece more and then I'm gonna in, end this video here. And then I'm gonna start part two, okay? Take a break, Miss Lynch. I got right up on the dashboard. So this guy got a nice little marine, a little, uh, um, what you call it in there, by a, a jetty, <laughs> a marina, for the boat service. Yeah, so we are at the end of this area. This place could be a nice place to set up a jetty by or a little marina where you can launch your boats and thing. Hey, to go fishing and get some boat tour and thing, you know. Trust me, it's real nice out here. So I want to thank you guys for being on my channel. Thank you for your time here. God bless you, take care of you and those around you. Be safe and stay tuned for part two of Wakenham Island. All right?